yesterday morning and we got here in time to watch a basketball game. Um, Legon played against uh, KNUST and it was a really good game, um, really good game. I think it was a semi-final so we got to see that and then yesterday afternoon they did athletics, this morning they've done athletics and I, I can tell you that the, the, the quality of the athletics competition has been unbelievable. I mean it compares very easily to, to any of the circuit competitions we've done. Uh, um, if I would speak uh, in a GA hat, I would say for me it's been very reassuring because what it's very clear is that uh, the level of athletics has, has, has actually risen. Yesterday we had a time of 54.8 uh, electronic uh, by uh, the young lady from UCC, Hajuana Hadju, yeah, Brahma, I think her name is. Unbelievable time, I mean. And then we had a 100 meter time of 10.3, uh, 36 or 10 by Edmond Yabua from also from UCC. But it's really good to see all the young kids. I mean, they all came through the school system. I mean, they've all been running circuit competitions and it's been really good to see that it's sort of translated into opportunities in college and university. And I think that's even more important than the athletic performance. And so it's been very rewarding here. We saw, uh, what's her name? Patience at Kwangoba in the 800, she ran 212, and you saw the 4x4 leg she ran, unbelievable, you know. So I, I'm just really excited. The javelin throw, men, I don't know what it ended up being, but from outside it looked like a 60 something meter throw. So it's been a really wonderful set of performances all around. Yeah. What is really changing with regards our tertiary institutions? Because we're not used to scholarships, you know, in, in, in time past. But Every university seems to be going for it. Well, I, I think what's happened uh, across some of the universities, I know we have it at the University of Ghana, is this facility that allows um, um, uh, talented athletes to get a better chance of admission. And I mean, clearly, University of Cape Coast is, is doing it. Clearly, University of Winneba is doing it. Maybe they're doing it differently. But what it means now is that athletes, um, really good athletes, have a chance to go to go into college. It may not be scholarships in the same sense as the U.S. thing, but at least here they're getting admission now and they're being able to go. And I, I could count maybe 30 or 40 uh, uh, young men and women who've run in our circuit competitions over the last two years who are in college now. And for me, that was the most beautiful thing about this competition. Yeah. Well, Prof, let's talk about your relationship with UG, Pro mm. Vice Chancellor. Um, congratulations and um, what, what really does a work entail? Thank you. I mean, um, essentially my job is to uh, try to grow the research uh, endeavor at the university. Uh, my predecessors have done a really great job, but it's a, it's a new office. I think it's just about six or, six or so years old. And so there's quite a bit that still needs to be done and hopefully we'll be up to the task. Um, Pray that God will sort of grace us to be able to do it. But it's exciting to be able to serve in your country in, what, in whatever capacity and, and to get a chance to do this for me is really, yeah, I'm happy, ecstatic. Yeah. Does it bring benefits to sports in Ghana? Well, at least once I have a job, I'll be able to do my other jobs in athletics and whatnot. But yeah, I mean, I think um, yesterday when we spoke to the University of Ghana, um, our Vice Chancellor was here yesterday, and when we spoke to the University of Ghana contingent, I mean, I think he used it as an example to the athletes to recognize that, okay, here's somebody who used to compete for Legon 30-something years ago, and if you see where he has been able to sort of get uh, uh, professionally, it should tell each and every one of you sitting in this room that these are goals, like professional goals goals that you can shoot for, quote unquote, even if you're an athlete, right? So hopefully, at least in that sense, it brings a, 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 a profit for our athletes. On the other hand, I mean, you, you get to meet more people, you get to meet more influential people, and hopefully it opens doors for our, our athletes and it opens avenues for which you can sort of get resources for our athletes. So I think it will, it will, it will help um, athletics in that sense.